Hey guys, welcome back to Barstool Outdoors. Uh, as you can see, I'm not in camo anymore. I'm actually in a little nicer clothes because I'm in Georgia taking the weekend off, gonna go to a baseball game tonight. I'm gonna change, but uh, I got lunch this morning and it's been great. So it's been good to not be in camo, but I do miss it. No, it's been so exciting though. I just got back from New Zealand. I've been showing and recapping my trip with you all and I hope you really enjoyed it. I showed you my Sika stag, which I'm super proud of. Dad and I were really, really thrilled to be able to shoot a buck at or a stag at that caliber, especially at 45 yards. I think I shocked myself too. I was just really excited. And then my fallow buck that I got with my brother. So it's been a, real, a lot of fun being able to experience that with my family, especially my brother who's getting ready to go to law school. My dad, who's been my my partner in crime since I was a wee lad, just a little girl, and uh, it's, been a, it's been a blast. But this video is gonna be a little different because it is a compilation of videos from throughout the trip. And I think you're really gonna enjoy it. So let's get into it. Alrighty, another day after a chasing big old deer. Dad's glass and a little bit. We're sitting up on top of this knoll looking at the bottom. It's not working yet. <laughs> so far, no luck. It's still early, sun is high, it's pretty warm today, so they're not moving just yet. Might get lucky and catch one, bed it down, and be able to put the sneak in on him before he stands up. I'm waiting. Just waiting here in New Zealand with my dad. Just waiting. I've been waiting. This has been a great trip so far, though. We've been able to stick some uh, animals with my arrow. It's hard to see these fallow deer, though, because they're pretty elusive and quick. When they run, they kind of remind me of a mule deer a little bit when they bounce. It's pretty cool. I want to come home with a billy goat with my blowgun, but it seems like everywhere we go, we go where Sydney wants to go. That's true. That's true. It's okay, though. <laughs> Oh. Time will tell. Let's get after it. What happened? I dropped my bow. Did you? I got excited. <laughs> I was right under 50 yards. About time you finally missed something. <laughs> if you would have done one of those, you know, drops. Smoked him. Smoked him. Here we go. Look at this guy. Oh, This is what a coal looks like because of his panel. So he doesn't get super wide and kind of like a white tail. You know what's a coal and what's not. Did a front shot. Died instantly. Look at the hair on him and the colors, the spots. I love New Zealand. Having a blast here, especially just hiking up and down the, the mountains and the dark timber. I feel like I'm in a movie. I feel like I am literally in the Lord of the Rings. <laughs> so much fun. his hair. He's giant and he's beautiful. Look how beautiful this guy is. Ah, 
We were just hanging out. We were walking around trying to find some animals. And I'm talking a little loud, but it's windy. They can't hear me. And this hair got me pretty pumped up. Look at that. We're gonna take him home, put him in our backpack and cook him up. Holy cow. Well, here we go, back at it. This morning we did a little cooling, which is a lot of fun. We went and stopped and had a great lunch. I showed you guys we actually ate sick of heart and fallow deer. So we've been eating what we've been killing, which has been really fun for me because I've never had fallow deer and I've never had a uh, sick of heart before and they both were delicious. So we're back at it. Uh, I just killed a rabbit, which you just saw. So it's the afternoon now. I got a little change. Wish me luck, cross your fingers. Let's get it. Wait, do I get up to you? Wait, wait, wait. What were you doing? We were walking on this trail looking for fallow deer. And oh my gosh, here he was eating and he's looking the opposite way. So I snuck in 65 yards, baby. Wow. What a shot, man. You're a killer. Look at this guy. Oh. oh my gosh. Look at this deer. Holy cow. Couldn't have been better either. He went uphill. You know their death march is never good when they go uphill because they always end up falling back downhill. So 65 yards, smoked him. Slock, baby. I'm getting it done here in New Zealand. I can't believe it. I'm pretty uh, happy. I'm feeling pretty confident and this just tops it off. Far distance shot and a beautiful deer. Getting the opportunity to even chase after these animals is incredible. And this, this kind of environment is so lush and just the trees and the different types of uh, plants. It's so, so different than the States. And these deer are just so beautiful that it's really exciting to chase after them. But that might top my trip here because that long distance shot, he literally went 50 yards. <sighs> Beautiful animals. So that trip was a blast. I was so dang pumped to be able to harvest those animals. I was super proud of myself and we obviously were eating pretty good in camp and brought a lot of the meat back to the States. But that was pretty much a wrap up of my international trips. And now we are flipping gears and we are filming the season two of Out of Office. We are meeting up with Donnie Does in the Bahamas and then we're going to the Florida Keys with Hannah Cook and Tommy Smoke. So I'm pumped. Out of Office is my favorite series to film and it's about to get rowdy. We're going to be fishing, boys and girls. New episodes coming soon. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And thanks for watching Barstool Outdoors.